What's up, YouTube? I'm DeFresh here. Um, it is Wednesday, the 11th. I uh, just got home from work and two packages. Um, actually, they were not on my front doorstep. And to me, the new day and age of hunting for sneakers because, uh, you know, they do the tickets, so you can't, like, go hunting for sneakers like that or... Um, you know, the buy-sell trades, the sold exchanges are great because it's a day of hunting, even though you're in one place. But um, like I've said in old videos, me, oh, damn, it's Vinny, Jersey Hits, we're all older, and we come from the day and the age where we could, uh, a Jordan released, we went and looked at it, we went home, maybe a week, sometimes later, we would go back and pick it up if we decided, waited for a paycheck or something. But uh, those days are kind of over. I don't know if they'll be back again, if maybe um, sneakers aren't as cool as they are right now because we liked it when it wasn't that cool, if that makes sense. But um, the new way of um, hunting, for me anyway, besides you know the normal hunt, um, silly, but when I get home and there's no packages on the front steps, like there should be, and there's that annoying little orange card in the mailbox, I grab the card, I jump in the truck, and I'm out. My town's not that big. It's a big square. It's a big grid. Um, my mailman knows me, obviously, because he's here very often dropping off these boxes. I don't even know if he knows that there's sneakers in them, but it's like the same size box all the time. But um, I take that little slip that says, you can pick it up at the post office tomorrow, and I just drive around. Um, are sh are the streets in my town are very straight across lined and I just keep going until I see that mailman truck and then I chase him down I pull over I run up to the truck and you know sometimes I catch him sometimes I don't today I got lucky and I caught him in my town and luckily I have the two boxes here to unbox um, <clears throat> these I know what these are and I think these are actually going to be for sale I wasn't planning on selling them, but uh, I'm not going to get into that right now. But if you are interested in these, they are DS. They should be. I'm only going to be asking what I paid for them. Um, if you're interested in these, my email is imdfresh at gmail.com. You can email me. If you're worried about, you know, uh, the, the whole not sending thing, there's plenty of plenty of references. You can look me up if you don't know me already by now. I mean, geez. But uh, shoot me the PayPal. You know, I'll give you the invoice. You send me the money PayPal. I ship it out priority tomorrow. Double box, probably right back in this box. But 97.5% chance I'm probably just going to sell these. Not that I got a good deal on them. Um, I just think I'm going to need a different size, to be honest. But if you're watching, I got these from Jeremy. Oh, damn. From Honolulu. No wonder these took so long. Yeah, these came from Honolulu. I'm sorry you have to spend your life back here in New Jersey now from Honolulu. But anyway, you got the, the uh, you know, the nice... I love this. I love this box. I wish Nike would just, you know, stop playing games and put all the sneakers in these the, these boxes. This should be the new sportswear box, in my opinion. But this is the, like, special Nike box now they're doing. Like, the Yeezy foam came in and whatever. But, um, really, does it cost that much to put everything in this, this box? I love this box. This box looks nice. Um, you have the, here we go. Nike, Roshi Run, I think it says FB, no, SP, SP, NMWSP, size 9 men's. Oh, oh, right off the back. They smell good. The Roshi Run... Great Britain, or whatever. Um, I, I'm like I said, I'm old school. Hanes sweatpants around the house. I love sweatpants. I've always loved sweatpants. And basically, 
you know, Great Britain flag, whatever, that's cool, and they on the back, yada, yada. But this is a sweatpants Roshi run. It's a Roshi run made out of sweatpants. I know, my lights, my, my lighting is always, it's always horrible in here. My camera sucks, but it's DS. You, you all know what it is. Um, basically, I'm going to try it on, see if I need to change my size, but 90% chance these are up for sale right now. So if you're interested in these, um, let me know. I think I paid 200 and change. I think I paid like 220 or something like that for these. I know it's not that good of a deal for, uh, maybe it is for these, whatever, but DS. Um, if you're interested in these, 200 shipped. Shoot me PayPal. Give me an email, adamdefresh at gmail.com. Size 9, DS. Um, yeah. On to the next box. If you saw my last unboxing, I've been saying how, um, since I'm here, this, is, this isn't a for sale video. But since I'm here, I have these uh, Yeezy Roshi Run, size 9. They were worn a couple times, but you can see the bottoms. They're, uh, they weren't worn a lot. They're clean, real clean. Uh, I am selling these. If you want these, 175 shipped, uh, priority, double boxed, shipped out. You know, tomorrow morning if I get the money today or the following day. If you send me the money early, I'll ship it out that day. Um, and I am also including with these the um, Yeezy laces. Let me stand in front, in front of the light. Whatever. The, the Yeezy laces with the threaded tips, the gold ones. Uh, I'm going to send with these for free. These are brand new, the laces, from Rope Lace Supply. So if you're interested for these, they're up for sale everywhere. Um, I just want a different size. Unless you have a size, 8.5, I'll do a straight-up trade for you. I want these to fit real tight. Um, these are for sale, 175 shipped, or best offer. Anyway, back to the goods. This box, I missed this on the release day. I was very upset. Um, we are a shark enthusiast family, if that makes sense. Me, my wife, my son, even though he doesn't know yet, he likes sharks. And Shark Week is a big deal in this house. And this sneaker came out, and I missed it, and I was so upset. It was something I've always wanted from when it first released back in the day. Uh, I finally got my hands on it at a decent price. I don't know if you are up on what this is, but this is a big box. It, it's not double boxed. This came from Samai? S-A-I-M-A -A in New York. Um, I'm not that... Oh, look, it, it came with a... Uh, a dead daddy long legs. Sorry, dude. Um, I'm I'm not really that upset that this isn't double boxed because, you know, for the, for the price I paid, it should have been double boxed. Anything should be double boxed for that amount of money that I paid. But it is a big box. I mean, I can understand how hard it would be to double box. But whatever. The box is in good shape. Maybe he figured it's going from New York to New Jersey. It's not that far. It didn't get. Doesn't seem to get banged up. Plus, my mailman looks out for me good. So, it is just wrapped in paper. And open. Uh, if you know what this is, you know the design, you know it's inside this box. I am hyped on this. This is the, oh, I think it's in. Really? All right, it's all good. It's not destroying it. Wrapping paper. I got a present. Cherish, honor, bliss, cherish, love, honor, bliss. Cool. Wrapping paper. Whatever, dude. Um, big ass box. This is the Blaze of Glory Puma. Um, same as this model here. If you don't know this model, it is a very snug fit. Almost like the, um, the what, what, what would fit like this? I guess like a Hirachi. Like a Hirachi. I'm a true to size 8.5. I wear a 9.5 in Hirachi. This is also a 9.5. I could probably get a 9, but it would be so hard to get on. Um, I'm not running in them, so whatever. But it is the 
sneaker finger collaboration with Puma. It is a U.S. size nine and a half. The box alone, I, I just, I love this. I love these shoes. I love the concept. I love supporting Sneaker Freaker. You know, all that, that, the people who support the sneaker community, all that stuff. And, you know, I don't really buy too many Pumas, let's be honest. When they put out a badass Puma like this, um, I've been looking for it since it released, and finally, whatever. The box is like, uh, like um, board game material. Yeah, board game. Yeah, it's like a... Monopoly box. Big, sturdy box. Uh, open it up. I'm going to put this camera down because there's all kinds of all kinds of goodies here. Opening up the box, you have this paper thing. It's folded up probably like the day you got it. It is a poster. Ooh. Oh, this might get a frame job. It's a big ass poster of the sneaker. Puma and Sneaker Figure Magazine present five years, 2008 to 2013, Blaze of Glory. So dope. Yeah, that's cool. Special packaging. I know we're here for the sneakers. We all like the sneakers, but special packaging. Nike, Puma, Reebok, Asics, Adidas. You hear me? Special packaging. It's just a nice treat. It doesn't cost you much. You have the box paper, which just sits over top. Then on the inside, awesome. Awesome. You have this little leather Puma satchel, if you will, to keep your Skittles. Um, where the extra laces are. You got black laces with the blue aglets. And they are metal. Sick laces. Sick. Ooh. They match. Um, yeah, so you got second set of laces. Cool little bag. And then inside the bag, it smells like leather. This is cool. I want to do something cool. Uh, you have the two little keychain things, little uh, shark teeth. There's two of them. Cool, 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 cool. All oh, cool stuff. Um, then inside here you have. It does come with two. He told me that um, when I when I got when I got these from the guy that sold them to me, he told me that he actually they're actually too small for him, so he's been wearing them. These are pre pre owned worn. He's been wearing them with no insoles because they fit that tight. So the insoles are brand new. You have the designed insoles with those cool triangles. And the one sl slot, and then the other slot here, you have the sneaker figure insoles. Um, I'm probably going to rock it with one of each, each shoe so that one stays preserved, whatever. Cool insoles. And then you have... The shoe itself, Sneaker Freaker and Puma collaboration, Shark Attack, Great White. This is the Great White. Uh, looking at him in hand, there's some midsole creasing. He's, you know, he did wear these. Um, I got a good deal compared to the other deals that are on eBay. No heel drag. You know, they could use a bath. I'll get Jason Mark out here to help me, but. Just a sick, just a sick shoe. It's just a sick shoe. There's really nothing else. Yeah. So yeah, um, we're gonna do a full review of these. Uh, I'm gonna slip these on. And cool. Mission accomplished. Sneaker figure collabs. I got them finally. Maybe I look for those black joints. Uh, stay tuned. More reviews coming. More vids. More unboxings. All that crap. Um, hit me up about the Roshis, the Yeezys. Hit me up about the Great Britons, the sweatpants. That's what I call them. I don't care. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. I'm Fresh. I'm out here.